it's time to learn how to download and install the driver for use on the Mac computer with your MA2100 CWFX printer for printing via the USB cable. Plug your USB cable into the printer. Plug the other end into your Mac computer. To download the latest Mac driver, go to https colon forward slash forward slash kiosera.info. This will take you to the download center. Here you should select your country or region. In our example, we're using USA. In the refine the product area, type in MA2100. Now click on the Echosys MA2100 CWFX. Select your operating system from the list. In this example, we're using Mac OS X 10.9 or later. Scroll down and find the Mac printer driver 10.9 and up. Click on the blue download button as shown. A license agreement will appear. Scroll to the bottom and select the agree to contract and download blue button. Open the downloaded file. A Kyocera OS X 10.9 Plus file ending in DMG will appear. Double click on the file. You have three options to use Kyocera OS X 10.9 plus the web build package. Mac Driver Setup Guide, or an Uninstaller Guide. Double-click on the first option. Click Continue. Click Continue again. Click Continue one more time. Click on Agree to continue installing the software. Next, click on Install. If a password's asked for, do so. The software will begin to install. This may take a few minutes, so please be patient. When the install is completed, a green check mark will appear. Click on Close. You can keep the install file or move it to the trash. Go to System Preferences, Printers, and Scanners. Click on the Plus button. Look for the Kyocera Echosys MA2100 CWFX with the kind defined as USB. Highlight it. The name should be Kyocera Echosys MA2100 CWFX. The location is the name of the Mac computer. You can change this to whatever you like. Assure that the Kyocera Echosys MA2100 CWFX is shown. Press on Add. The printer will now appear as active. You can make your newly installed Kyocera printer your default printer meaning any print job from this computer will automatically print to your Kyocera printer. You can also select sharing preferences as needed by clicking on this box. Select the default paper size you will be using. In most cases, you will be using US letter. Press the red close button here. You have now installed your Kyocera MA2100 CWFX printer for USB.